Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Harvest Moon Back to Nature. This time we have made it to uh, summer of the second year. And the day of the swim race, the sea festival, the summer festival, whatever it's called. I'm gonna try to ruin it again. If you didn't win it last year, now is when you would get the power berry. But we gotta continue our reign, you know? Wouldn't be right not to. Okay, so obviously today's festival, we got the chicken festival on the 7th. So I will enter a new chicken to get a chance to get a gold egg. Tomato festival. This time I'll be on Karen's team. Cow festival will be held at the Yodel Ranch. Okay, ooh, good. And the firework display. Nice, nice, nice. So, uh, obviously the fun festivals are in summer. And then it'll be nice getting the Cow Festival 1. There wouldn't be any issue with Bessie winning. And honestly, at this point, Cowie probably has a fair chance of winning as well. So, last episode, I bought seeds in preparation for summer. So, I'll probably plant those before I go swim, but I won't water till afterwards. Because honestly, if I lose the swim race, I'll reset, and that way I don't have to do all the watering do just to reset and do it again. As always, I do not have much confidence in myself in, uh, in the swim race. So the closest birthday is going to be Potpourri's on the 3rd. So I might give her one wrapped gift. I for sure won't do more than one gift regardless, but I'm trying to decide. I don't want to affection hype anybody up. Oh, and for the uh, cow festival, you just want to make sure that you do not have a cow that is pregnant and not enter them. Just keep that in mind. Look at you, Moo Moo. Aww. You know what, I'm gonna save that one. Thank you, Moo Moo. I was not expecting that. I will at least water the four in the greenhouse. Those don't take long. And I gotta kill time till 10 anyway. Yay, Moo Moo. Flash. Yeah. Of course, you cannot give gifts to anyone today, so we'll just be... Selling all the eggs, or the mayonnaise, whatever. Go. Not any reason in particular I'm saving up all those small milks, but... I mean, I will need milk for some recipes. But honestly, by the time my cows get grown and stuff like that, it might be easier just to store large, because that's going to be what I have the majority of. But we'll see. Oh, corn. Nice. Where am I at on chicken feed? In 64. Alright, I will store four. I say store, but I will give four for chicken. Not that chicken feed is expensive, but I really do like that feature. I just. I don't know. It feels cool to be like self. Oops. <laughs> Extra watered corn. It feels cool to be self sufficient in that regard. And where are we with onions? Uh, oh, okay. The so same where we were last time I paused. Funny enough. Ooh, let's see. Summer also unlocks a new kingfish that we can get. And this one will also be in the ocean. So yay to that. But after that, there'll just be one more. Happy summer, everybody! How many times do I forget that? Every time. Every time is the answer. Hi, 
my back again. Wasn't just gonna feed one of you. I think last episode too, I was talking about trying to decide if I wanted to cook on screen. And I was kind of talking it out with uh, like my brother and they're wanting their opinion. And I think I might do it. Not do it all in one go like I was planning on doing off screen. But... You know, showing that off to about getting the recipes. Maybe I'll, you know, at a time do four recipes or something like that. Then I'll knock it out pretty quickly. I've already done eight so far. So, an eighth of the way done on that. And honestly, a lot of the recipes are not difficult. Of course, that's the same way in real life. It's just following the, uh, the instructions. But yeah, somewhere we go back to just the two forgeables. So of course, I will start saving those eventually. Oh good, and our pink catmint flowers. That I bought 12 bags of. I will take the time to pl I might do those afterwards. Again, I had to do a bunch of work before the festival and then do a terrible, terrible job. You... All right, I definitely need to keep the hoe out because of having to get rid of weeds that have grown on the plots. So, pineapple. Right now. I think those are onions. Already planted those. those. Yeah. And. That, so I don't waste the hard bought seeds. <laughs> After I just replaced them. <laughs> yeah, I only did five. Yeah. This is I was thinking I had more seeds than this. Hmm, maybe not. Okay, guys, you, uh, you ready? I know you don't have to win it after you've already won it, but as I said, I like to keep my brain going. And it boosts affection, of course, when you win. And we have to beat Kai. to the mayor until you're ready to start the event. Good morning. It's the ocean, so it's not as easy as swimming in a lake. Be careful. If anything happens to me, Karen, I want you to know that you are 100% beneficiary. I'll be waiting for you at the finish line. Do your best to swim all the way there. Doesn't matter if you win, the important thing is participate every year. Absolutely, Jeff. Proud of you each time. Grandpa ordered me to join in opening day. He's so bossy. 
He worried about Jeff. All the others are so young. He always comes in last. And I think he has a complex about that. Power is important in swimming, but you also need technique. I won't be beaten by youngsters. Hey, Ellie. Did you do any warm-up exercises? No. I'm good at swimming, too, but I can only do the dog paddle. Hey, as long as you're keeping yourself above water, it's pretty darn good. Hi, May. I'm not supposed to swim in the ocean yet. When I was young, I used to swim in the sea even in the winter. Good luck, I want to swim too, but I can't see well without my glasses. I think everyone's at a pink heart. Hopefully it might be yellow. Okay, you're in the race? Good luck. All right, Kai. Bring your swimsuit. Did you bring your A game? Ooh. Hey, Dr. Tim. I always recommend people swim for their health. Oh, hey guys. I'm not participating. There's no beach where I grew up, you see, so I can't swim. And I think Anne's yellow. Do your best. Yeah. Okay, so everyone's green, but Anne and of course Karen. All right, guys. <sighs> Got this. like all their little pre-warm-up stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I love that fish jumping. And remember, you might as well start pressing before the mayor says go. for winning twice. Yeah, I started out doing the normal kind of like, you know, five presses and then holding triangle. But then I kind of was like, you know, let me do a little shorter spurts. Congratulations, Ian. This is the prize for the winner. You guys are all... What did you give me? One piece of lumber? What? <laughs> One piece of lumber is my victory? <laughs> oh, wow, Mayor, you uh, really shout out a lot for that one. All right. Wow, you won. Doing heavy labor really pays off. Hey, you made it. Help me if I start to drown, okay? Of course, Poe. Of course, pal. Oh, that's pretty hard work. Especially if you win. What a letdown. Oh, it's no big deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Congratulations, looks like you've been swimming for years. Well, at least two now. Oh, you're a pretty good swimmer. Great didn't do well at all. Congratulations, but you still have to work today, right? Are you okay? Yeah. Thank you for noticing, Maria. Mary. You're so fast. Teach me to swim like that, okay? Starting with how to breathe. do it after all. Jeff, seriously, I'm proud of you. Every year you go out there, especially people being a lot younger than you, good for you. Wow, you're a great swimmer. I'm impressed. Hooray, you did it. You did it, you did it. Too bad, but next year for sure. It's important to put your all into everything, right? Congratulations. Thank you. Doo -doo. Wow, Ian, you're awesome. I know. Darn it, Grandpa's going to chew me out again. Shoot. You did pretty good, Ian. Well, Sasha, don't gush too much. Well, congratulations. You don't look up, but you're a regular athlete. Yeah, thanks everyone for pitching in together to get this awesome prize. 
I guess it's supposed to be a throwback to Mineral Friends of Mineral Town. I think there was like a gold lumber you could get, and it made people not like you if you put it out in your yard or something. Might be misremembering. I never played. I played part of the remake, but I've never played the original. So maybe you guys can can tell me. But then I thought that's what I gave Gots was that special lumber or whatever. Well, regardless, we won. Right. So in summer, that is this season. I don't know if I've counted out 12 or how many plots I've dug. But wait, there's more. Five left. Oh, I might get pretty close. Well, I'm actually, I'm actually impressed with myself. Just uh, three things short, three plots. Oh boy, boy. Oh boy, oh boy. I think I might keep that piece of lumber in my inventory. <laughs> yeah, that that's really funny. Or maybe it's more than one piece? Maybe that's it. I'll, I'll try that and see if it magically shoots me up to 999. Yeah, how do you compare the first time you get a power berry and then this one you just get lumber? But actually, I did like that it told you all the uses for it. Um, you know, when I pressed the little explanation button or whatever, it mentioned about putting it in the fireplace and using it as fences. I have not been counting how much water I have left. I bet it! Swimming and then doing a bunch of watering, just like last year. This is why we want rain. Rain and also more rain, no summer storms. Well, at least watering up here, we won't have as much to do. And plus, the pineapples will take forever. Oh, actually, I, you know what? I think I did say I was going to plant the rest of my onions out here. That must be why I thought I would have. Who knows, guys? Who knows what I was thinking? That's the short of it. So let's see. Also this season, I will have my birthday. Yay! And I'm sure I'll forget when it actually is. Also, yay! And I will get uh, probably another cow and sheep. I think I might get up to 10 for now. Summer 7. Yeah, th so that is what I was planning. The three. Or no, I think I only did two tomatoes. I don't know, guys. Just. just it's been hard trying to think. Trying to keep up with what I'm trying to do? Come on. Okay, okay, I got it. I'm on, I'm on track with myself. And this is six, seven. There we go. And of course, I will probably get some sprites to help me do some of the watering. You notice how I didn't say my, uh, my phrase. Not setting myself up for that one right now. Woo wee! One more and then it's bed free. Well, then it's a hot spring. Mm. 
And then I'm gonna put the lumber in and, and again, see if it does more than gives me one lumber. I, I don't know, actually, you know what? I might store it and try to look up about it because it's like it's thing I can actually utilize. I don't wanna, I don't wanna waste it. Either way, it was a successful first day. And I'll go ahead and play the second day as well. And then my next episode, I'll plan on doing the third and the fourth because I got two birthdays. And there I'll hire the sprites to water. Let's see who I can get for that. So I think I had Chef help out with I think I hired him to take care of my animals one time. Of course, it didn't happen. So maybe I'll get Chef Nappy. Timid already waters. So maybe I'll get those four to help me with watering the top four. I'll buy them flowers. Appreciation gifts. And honestly, I might put them to work for a week just to see. night. We will sleep very well after a full day. Good morning, sassy. We are swimming champions, my dog. And all that we won was a log. What could be in the cabinet? Oh, an award-winning lumber. Woohoo! Thursday, so usual stuff today, but again, I will go in to the supermarket for flour and get some sprites. I'm also going to start giving gifts to Kai. Okay, I'm gonna say, where are you? Ooh, I think my grass is getting ready. Apona. All right, well, I'm not gonna spend all morning hunting you down. Hi, everybody. Oops. <laughs> you know, in Wonderful Life, you can uh, bathe them. It's actually really cute to do that. But I got annoyed with the Wonderful Life early on because the cow that you start with, which, hey, it's great, you start with the cow, but that cow is so temperamental. It, get mad, it gets mad if you don't feed it, of course, but then I would feed it by hand because that was supposed to make it like you better, and that did not matter. I'd get in there at six in the morning to feed the cow, and it was already, like, mooing in anger at me. I just woke up. The very first thing I came in to do was to feed you. Yeah. You'd let it outside and it'd be a little bit happy. But then you'd bring it back inside and it would be mad. And anyway, yeah. I think I finally just started feeding it every lumber I could. I mean, every lumber. Every water I could. I don't know why I didn't like me when I was giving it lumber every day. Yeah, I would like to replay that one because it my first impression was eh. Oops, sorry, I did the wrong button. My, my bad. Opponent says, I am coming, sheesh. Okay. That was all me, Opona. Oh good. should put us at, what, 54 onions? Yay! 
Yay! We can get, uh, should be able to get pumpkins. I think. And I have to see what I want to plant to uh, replace this. Let me see what, what, what we're at. I could probably do carrots. Yeah, it'll be pumpkins I unlock. I can do carrots and probably do green peppers in fall itself because they will regrow. And I think once they grow, they come back like every three days. I want to say it's a pretty quick uh, turnaround. So I will buy carrots. Cool, cool, cool. So I overall do feel okay on the other bachelor's affection since I spent pretty much a month giving them gifts, but I might just do a little bit more. You know, since they don't have something that you can gauge, I don't think they really have scenes. I think any of the scenes are based off of the girl's affection. But I should have a couple Cliff and Anne scene. Uh, excuse me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Didn't realize you would give in that easily. But yeah, the only thing different this month, of course, is Kai. Still give Cliff stuff. I guess it could be nice and give Rick something. Not that I owe him anything. You know, Karen was free game. At any point she expressed discomfort, I would have backed off. Besides, Rick needs to get himself in order, you know? tell Rick that he's got to get some of his other stuff uh, situated in life. So, okay. Get my flowers. And I will make my way back to the house, pick up some bread for Kai, although I don't think he'll really be out on the beach until the afternoon. And you know, I actually might want to... Ooh, I probably should have planted it yesterday, because I think he'll still come and ask for corn. I don't know, maybe I'll be able to have some saved in my inventory. Maybe I'll do that. I'll kind of play and I'll figure out what day he comes. I can give him corn. Alright, let's get him some frozen bread. I'll get some ore for Cliff. And maybe, uh, what's today? Thursday of Greg will be out fishing. You're so cute, sassy. Oh, you know what? I don't know how we... Oh, I guess we have seen the puppies. <laughs> Are two different types of, uh, lumber or sticks, whatever. Gray. Maybe I can catch him coming from the inn. I think he should be leaving around 10. Closed today, the blacksmith shop is. Yeah, maybe I'll catch him out walking. Okay. Maybe he comes from the blacksmith shop. I don't know. I don't remember. You in here, Cliff? Oop. 
Good morning, sir. Oh, thank you, Ian. You're a nice guy. You should stay. I'm going to stay at this inn as long as I have the money. There you go. And as long as you have spa boiled eggs, right? That'll keep you going. Hi, Doug. Or I can't pay you 10 gold to use your phone anymore. Oh, that's what I forgot. Uh, I forgot, um... I'm looking for the doctor. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, hello. You startled me. Hey. Hey. I guess I'll go home and eat. It's tough living alone. Here, Karen. Allow me to go before you. <laughs> All right, so there's bread here. So I said I wanted to buy some carrots. So I'm at eight. 80 something, I think, 84, 81. So, I'll probably just buy three, that way I have some to store. Of course, I need the. Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and buy some more. Not that I need it, but. Another thing to get maxed out is get 99 fish. Uh, sure. Oh, if only I had to buy one thing of flour. Then I'd be at an even dollar amount at the end. Oh, that's 50, not 10. Never mind. Woo wee! I do. I will be back tomorrow to do the same. I don't have anything to give you, doctor, but you guys doing all right? I really do wonder if I missed out with Ann and Cliff since he's no longer staying at the church as much. I don't even know if he goes in there at all, now that he's working at the vineyard. Okay, now I know for sure Timid. So he's the yellow one. Who else did I say? Nappy. Alright, so orange, red, yellow, and green. Orange, red, yellow, green. One week. Oh, that's a good attitude. Thank you. Yahoo! You know, he looks a lot more mustardy in his little sprite uh, picture above his text. Have you come to ask me for help? I actually prefer sleeping to any kind of work. <laughs> okay, you'll have friends to help. <laughs> I don't want to be busy for too long. Oh, okay, just come work a week for me. I have. I would love to put you to work cooking. I will just give you my recipe list, and you can just go from there. It will be fine by me. Yeah, do make sure, especially if you're har uh, <laughs> hiring them for a long period of time, that you do give them flour. You might not have to do it every single day, but I would do it at least every other day. You startled me. 
he should be better about watering than the rest of them. Also, I do wish, like, as they liked you more, that they would have better techs. Like, they'd be more excited, or as they got experience, like the other ones that are more experienced with harvesting, that they would be, yippee, I love that, or something like that. I don't know, I guess it's hard to come up with so much distinct dialogue, which is why so many of the characters say the exact same thing. You in here, Mary? Here you go, Mary. Oh, thank you, he. Well, hi, you've come to read. I'm impressed. Again, I don't know if I should take that as a compliment that she's just impressed I've come in or she's really surprised that I know how to read. Here you go, Basil. Oh, I like how pretty the bag of carrots look. Thank you, you know what I like. Be able to go upstairs soon. Oh, I forgot to go see Kai. Well, that's okay. He probably won't be here till afternoon anyway. I'll see if I can get into the blacksmith. Oh, I will also get a, uh, probably get a cheese maker just to have it checked off the list. Thanks, it's important to have friends. Sounds like you two need to hash that out there, Gray. Yeah, I really do like his character in uh, the Story of Seasons Friends of Mineral Town. You really do get to see like his character development, getting a bit more confidence and Kind of starting to understand where his grandfather's coming from. And actually, even in this one, that's kind of like what Mary helps him. Which is cute. You know, like she's understanding, but she doesn't let him feel sorry for himself. And... You out here, Kai? Maybe next episode I'll try to go for that legendary fish. Where are you, buddy? Food, drink, food, drink. Wait, is this like Final Fantasy VII Remake? I can rest on a blue bench. There we go. Thank you, you're the only guy who's nice to me. Hey, how's it hanging? You know of anything interesting going on? I've got free time lately. Oh. Okay, I was not expecting that. The firework display isn't for like a month. Alright, well, I was gonna invite Karen, but you know what? She's already maxed out. Let's ask him. Thanks, but that guy who drinks at the end will be there too, you know? You say we should make up and be friends? You talk like we're kids or something. Okay, okay, you're right. I'll meet you at the beach. Oh, wow, I was not... I actually forgot you could invite him. Oh, hi, want something to eat? Yeah, just some water. Yeah, I mean, like I said, the Firework Festival, I think, is on the 25th. So, alright, well. I wonder if, come the 25th, I'll remember that I invited Kai at the beach. It's actually kind of funny. <laughs> well, there we go. So, we are befriending Kai. We awkwardly asked him to go to the Firework Festival with us. And hopefully he made up with Rick. Or is in the process of making up with Rick. Whatever that looks like. Hey, Rick, just want to let you know that uh, I's gonna make up with you. You're welcome. Oh, why'd you care? Jeez, what does Rick do during the day? Well, then. Alright, guys, well, it is already 40 minutes recording. So, all I'm going to have left to do is do watering. So, I will uh, go ahead and do all that off screen. And I might end the video here, and then I guess I'll just see if there's any other events that happen. But I will plan on just cutting it here. So, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for watching me crush the swim race. And I will plan on seeing you guys on the third. Thanks! <laughs>